I had a real passion for football growing up and I thought refereeing was another great opportunity to get involved. I started again when I was 15, now 23, so really been enjoying it since. After the first game, really got a hook for it and then progressed up ever since. I've been coaching Red for five years now. He's dedicated. Um, he comes across very well to players. He's just got that ability to remember facts, players' names, and he uses it with his communication. Fitness-wise, he's up there as fit as anybody that you see. When he's working, he goes out on training runs. He's as dedicated as anyone. Ultimately, you've got to be performing. You're not going to get there by no performance. So if you've got to be good enough, you've got to be working hard off the pitch as much as you are on the pitch. So learning-wise, again, watching my clips back, saying, what did I do well? What can I do better it? Probably highlight was last year getting the Sussex Senior Cup final at the Amex. Fantastic opportunity to referee at Premier League grounds. Great team of officials, great fixture, Worthing versus Bogner, local derby, just a great experience, family in the crowds. My coach Phil Wilkes was there watching. It's really, again, the hard work you put in throughout the years. Also getting promoted as well to level three, so again, now operating games on the National League, which is something you almost kind of look and go, God, they're the opportunities. You start off and just start off and get the grounds like this, and then now you're operating at National League level with um, two, 3,000 fans. That was massive, uh, massive for him and fully deserved. I think it's the next step, so in a couple of seasons it wouldn't surprise me if he was lucky enough to be nominated for another big appointment at some point. He could go all the way. He, he is uh, a talented individual both on and off the pitch. Even now, if I get a National League appointment, it's, uh, it's pretty awesome. So really just keep going as high as I can. If I get onto the Football League, that would be pretty amazing. If I stop enjoying it, then there's no point in me doing it. So I'd say just keep the enjoyment going. But if I can progress as high as possible, that'd be amazing.